there are three conclusions to be drawn. First, no time can be wasted. Time is the most precious asset. Putin acts quickly. After the shameful failure in 2022, he managed to regroup his forces and strengthen the offensive. He has clearly shown of having no intentions to step back. Second, their mindset should be changed. This is not Ukraine's war. This is a war in Europe. The impact of this war is felt all over the West, and there is no way to escape its severe reality. It should be met with mature responsibility. The bravery of the Ukrainian armed forces gave the Western politicians two vital years to get better prepared and make the right choices. Third, every effort should be streamlined at diminishing the military might of Russia and its potential to continue or repeat the aggression. It means that there is no room for any slightest compromise with the collective security. No argument, no hesitation, no self-doubt sh should undermine the defensive priorities. The exhaustive delivery of weapons to Ukraine's sanctions, use of Russia's frozen assets in Ukraine's interests, and the broadest international solidarity, all of these tasks must be taken with exceptional accuracy and seriousness.